select metric select metric select ok <coughs> the exercise we are going to cover is fan blade it is having an arc of radius 30 subtended by 105 degree and an arc of 50 arc of 50 radius approximately subtended by 170 degree two fillets or 10 or 25 two circles or 12 and or 20 distance between the center this point that is center of the circle to this point is 80 80 and from here to here the distance is 20 so we have two uh, limits L-I-M-I-T-S type limits lower left corner 0 comma 0 upper right corner 300 comma 210 enter uh, go to snap <coughs> settings set this value snap on grid on display grid beyond limits it is select say ok then draw a rectangle right draw a rectangle right so draw a circle at 230 comma 60 radius 12 draw another circle okay go to post snap settings select uh, of the snap on go to center is already there select touch 20 radius draw a line from the center vertically up yeah. 80 type 80 enter draw another line length 20 enter oh, there is error delete this error and delete this error there is error so that is the end of the exercise this is the end of the exercise and So now uh, draw go to our command our command our command is move center option enter enter this line select starting point is here somewhere start point is uh, uh, is relative polar coordinate shift at 30 less than symbol 90 degree enter and uh, subtended angle will invoke angle option uh, by typing a and uh, enter the value 105 so now i am going to after completing the arc i am going to draw a line it will ask the start point don't select the start point and uh, just uh, select enter so drag it is coming up to the circle select enter this is a continue option from the previous uh, arc next go to our command again now say so invoke center c option select this uh, point at the that is end of 80 millimeter uh, line select uh, start point is this end point and I'm going to draw a clockwise arc. So use <coughs> invoke angle option. Type A, enter. Include angle is uh, minus 170. So now I'm going to use fillet commands. Go to fillet. Use the radius option. Enter. Set the value 25. 
select the cancel snap and select this arc and the circle again select the fillet radius type r enter select uh, type the value 10 select the line and uh, circle so this uh, geometry is completed now i'm going to do dimension go to dimension command radius dimension select this and uh, enter select this enter select this enter select here and uh, i'm going to do dimension diameter dimension command select this circle enter select this uh, circle dimension linear select the center touch the center end point ok again next end point select now I am going to dimension continue dimension and uh, select the end point enter so dimension completed I remove these lines delete go to erase command select this line select this line right click and uh, I am going to remove this uh, dimension uh, extension lines how to do dimension dimension style go to modify go to fit draw dimension line between extension line deselect you can understand selection dimension line extension deselect it is cancelled say ok set current close so all the extension line is removed and uh, now you can see that the center mark is also there if there is a no center mark you can create center mark of the circle or now i am going to add a line weight to this uh, uh, elements of the geometry go to select these objects of the uh, geometry right and select here and uh, show line weight show line weight and escape you will see that and i can type name of this object that is type t times roman select 10 or font size and uh, and that is the end of the exercise this is the end of the exercise and uh,